All right, so I'm gonna be going over how to use background sounds on iOS 15 and Apple shortcuts. So basically what this is is a way to have some music in the background while you're doing other things. And what's cool about this is when you use it with the shortcuts app and you click on that shortcut, it just starts playing that tone. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go into your settings to get this set up. So you need to go into settings, click on accessibility, and then you wanna click on audio and visual. So from in here, you're gonna see the option for the background music and you just wanna click on it. Now, when you do this, you have some different options. They currently have seven different tones you can use, and the ones that I like are the stream and rain option. I think those are the two best, uh, but whatever. Hopefully, they add some more in the future. Okay, so that's basically how you get it set up at first, but if you want to actually create a shortcut and get these you know, tones playing when you open up that shortcut, we're going to need to go in the shortcuts app. All right, so from in here, I'm gonna do this from scratch. I'm just gonna create a uh, shortcut. And I think we're just gonna go with Instagram because I've got an icon already set up. So what you wanna do is, you know, select a new one here and then you wanna, you know, do the open app option. All right, so after I do open app, the next thing I'm gonna search for is a second command, which is gonna be background music. So if you just type in background, it should pop up. Okay, and then basically we're good to go. I'm just gonna name this Instagram and give it its own app icon. All right, and boom. All right, now I'm gonna go open it up and we should hear the, uh, you know, the background sound start playing. All right, the moment of truth. All right, and there you go, guys. Like I said, this is pretty cool. I didn't realize you could do this, and I don't know if it was on this beta 3 update that they made this available, but, you know, it works pretty well. Okay, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, quick tip. also want to let you know we have an iOS newsletter, so if you do want to get in on that, I'll throw a link in both the description and comments. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.